Hi, day 19. Just a few more days. I can't. Can't wait. I know. <laughs> no, it's been great. It's been yeah. really great. But we are nearing the end of our fast. And we thought today we would share a little bit about where this theme, Have Your Way, came from. Last fall, we did the Daniel Fest with our church in August, which we do every year. And Justin and I were praying about several things that we had on our hearts. One was we were looking at a different home, one with a little more square footage. The second thing was some a dream that we have, and I'll let you explain that uh, about the cargo van. The van, yeah. yeah. Oh, you want me to explain that? Yeah, just okay. short. Yeah, well, one, the dream is to actually get a van, one of those transit vans, those Ford Transits mm -hmm. or something like that, and then and then outfit it. I like to do a bunch of carpentry and woodworking, and so I can actually build that out to to be like a mini motorhome. Yeah, and like so, a camper van, so yeah. we can travel and see yeah. the country and when Justin re retires in a few years. So we were praying about that. Then we were also praying about my new book and the timing of releasing that, and I'd send out emails to agents, and so we had all these things that we were praying about. And after the fast, we just both felt like the Lord was saying, wait. Yeah. So, I mean, <laughs> we were really That's excited. Hard. Yes, yeah. these were things we were really excited about, but God was very clear that it was not the right time. So Justin and I were both in a place where we could have pushed on ahead and said, this is what we want to do, or we could have surrendered and we chose surrender. So we, in essence, were saying, have your way, Lord, we want what's best. Yeah. And out of that Daniel fast, also, as we said, God, whatever you want in your perfect timing, uh, the Lord showed us that very clearly that Justin needed to go back to school, which was not something that we had even considered or prayed about, yeah. but- Or that I wanted to do. <laughs> so again, he had to surrender yeah. and say, okay, have your way. And so now he's back in school. So I say all that, we say all that to just encourage you to kind of let you know where this theme came from and how it was birthed in us. And we're still in that waiting period on all of those things. And so we're trusting the Lord to work it all out in his perfect timing. Yep. So to end today, we just have a question for you. What is the Lord showing you, or what has he shown you on this fast that you need to surrender and pray to him? Have your way, Lord, you know? Yeah. I don't know if there's anything else for you, even. Not right now. Yeah, it's a daily yeah. thing. Surrender is daily. Yeah. So think about that, and maybe you're already journaling about what God's doing. Send me a testimony if you have something to share. But we just wanted to kind of let you know where we've been, where we are, and the history behind Have Your Way. It's been a great theme. Mm -hmm. It's not easy to surrender. No. <laughs> Never, but it's always worth it. Well, that's it for today. Only a few more days. Yeah. We'll see you tomorrow. All right. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.